you know, it's... Now, you've been embattled in this conflict for quite a long time, and I've got to imagine that the way you look at the world, the way you, you see things many, many steps ahead, do you see any sort of a logical conclusion to this process? Do you see any light at the end of the tunnel, or do you see uh, an impossible to avoid conflict? Like, do you, what, what do you see when you look at this whole thing long term? Well, I would say I can't look at it long term. And the reason for that is that, and this is why I get a kick out of all the Kek, Kekistan boys. You know, I do believe that what we're is, in a period of chaos. What's a Kekistan? Kek, oh, Kek is a mythological country that's ruled by chaos, by the god Kek, who's a frog, by the, who's a frog, as it turns out. Um, uh, so I don't, know, I don't know about this. this oh, is, well, you need to look them up. That's a big internet thing, Kekistan. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. A big internet thing? All I know about the frog thing. is the frog, the Trump frog, mm -hmm. the Pepe the frog, who, they've, who is apparently so distraught that his frog has been used to uh, yes, align Yes, he killed with, him off. Eh? Yeah, he killed him off, but good luck. He didn't. <laughs> All right, so the that's peop stupid the peop because the that's people who were, um, who were using Pepe, I haven't got the story quite right, but I'll get it mostly right. The people who were using Pepe as a meme. There um, it is. Used, yeah, that, that's Republic it. Republic of Kekistan. Yeah, this so they, is hilarious. So, so they used this symbol, K-E-K, -E uh -huh. to replace L-O-L. And the reason they did that was because K-E-K -E in Korean means L-O-L. And so it was just this little joke. Kek, K-E-K. -E well, then somebody found out these were people who were using Pepe, remember. It's a frog. Then people found out that Kek was an Egyptian god. And he was a frog. And he was between categories. Sort of like a transsexual, by the way. He was between categories, and so now they have this Republic of Kek, and it's ruled by this Egyptian god whose name is Kek, who's a frog. Hold on, go back, go back. Don't, don't keep changing this. Jamie's doing this in the background while you're talking, but look at this. There's a frog with a Make America Great Again hat, and he's, he's got like a tombstone. It says, those who served in the meme war, 2015 and 2016, we are the gods of the great meme war. We are the shit posters, the legion of Keck. We are the internet, the death of the normies. Lulz and Keck, we are one. What in the fuck is going on? That, that is the question, and that's the question <laughs> you ask me. And my answer was, I don't know. We're in a period of chaos. We're in a period of chaos, and in a period of chaos, the time horizon shrinks because no, because the outcome is uncertain. Well, this seems to be truly embracing chaos. I mean, just that statement, the frog, the Donald Trump thing with the hat on. This this is one of the things that seems to me to be uh, a reoccurring feature in this whole uh, chaos ballet that we're watching play out, is that people are enjoying the fact that Donald Trump sucks as a president. They don't feel threatened by it. They like it. And they don't, don't like it because they want to burn this motherfucker to the ground and torch this thing and like a phoenix we will rise from the fire. No, no, it's not that. It's that they, they are enjoying that it's falling apart. This is why they, we are the shit posters. Do you know what shit posting is? Yeah. Jamie, explain shit posting. You're really good at explaining it. Yeah. You're, you do. Posting for like literally no reason other than to get someone mad. It's almost like trolling, but it's like a, a separate level of trolling, right? That's right. a good way to say it. Yeah, yeah. it's a good way to say Provocation it. for its own sake. Jamie's right. the first person to uh, tell me about shit posting. I wasn't aware. Mm -hmm. Till about what, a year ago? Yeah, I think it was, yeah, right around about pre election time. I did not know. 